The city has 21 billion gallons of raw sewage coming into its waterways. What green roofs do is they absorb rainwater and prevent rainwater from going into the sewer system. The green infrastructure plan is a very important aspect of how we'll stop combined sewer overflows, which are caused by stormwater inundation of our antiquated sewer system. When you take a big step back and think citywide, you could prevent hundreds of millions of gallons of stormwater, of polluted sewage from reaching our waterways by introducing green practices on a large scale. Green roofs actually cool the environment. Esto ayuda a aliviar las temperaturas en, uh, en el verano, por ejemplo, nivela la temperatura en la comunidad. We're surrounded by lots of industrial uses in a city like New York. We have not only industrial operations happening, which can bring pollutants into the atmosphere, but you have tons of trucks and cars that's putting particulates and soot into the air we're breathing. Green roofs and the plants that are up here help capture those pollutants that we would otherwise be breathing. And so it's helping to improve air quality. And there's one of those cars now. You can see on this roof, there are a lot of native plants. We have here a microcosm of an ecosystem. The bees pollinate other plants to help the plants stay alive and beautiful. No, beneficia a la comunidad entera y no solo a la comunidad humana pero a la comunidad animal eh, hay muchos animales que buscan refugio y, y este es un espacio para ellos también aquí en este proyecto podemos enseñarle a los niños cómo empezar podemos inculcarles esa pequeña esperanza de que las generaciones en el futuro tengan la respuesta de poder sanar todo el daño que le hemos hecho a nuestro planeta, de poder darle las gracias, darle el amor a nuestro planeta.